are two ways we recommend creating a lead or contact in Outlook. The first way is very simple. You go to the Create a New Record button in the top left corner and select Lead or Contact. Then input the information in the side panel, and bam, you're done. Or you can go directly to the side panel and create a lead or contact there. If you go to the customer's email you received, you'll see a yellow Create a Lead and a blue Create a Contact button in the side panel. When you click on one of those buttons, you'll notice that the information from the customer's email signature has been pulled over into the new record. If this doesn't happen for you, then you probably don't have signature extraction set up yet. To do that, you'll need to go to Settings, and then go to Signature Extraction. If you want to save time in the future, set it to Autofill Form, and Serious Insight will always know to pull information from the email signature when creating a new lead or contact record. Once you've got that set, just exit out of the settings window, finish inputting the information in the side panel, and hit save, then you're done. You'll see the new lead or contact record appear in the side panel. You can edit contact records here as well. Let's say Cheryl has changed her phone number and you need to update the record. All you need to do is open the leader contact record, go to the details tab, and select edit in the bottom right corner. Update the information and hit save. It's really that simple.